plutonium reserves and what have you. So again, Netanyahu feels like he's in a bit of a, a corner. He had promised uh, the president that he was not going to uh, advance any of his military options against Iran. But <coughs> now he feels like he might be in a corner because if something happens with Iran, he's got nowhere to go. Again, we'll uh, perhaps you should uh, just... Uh, let me, jump ahead, in, let me jump in here just a second because I think part of the other reason why the president may be here, and I've heard some pundits talk about this, and that is that California has always been a stronghold for the president. And as a result of some of the problems he's having with Obamacare and some of the other issues, maybe immigration and, uh, and some other issues, he's really lost a lot of support here in California where before it was a, a, a sure thing. It was a sure, sure thing in Hollywood. He could raise a lot of money here. And even some of his most ardent Hollywood supporters are starting to defect, so he may be doing some fence mending as well. That makes a lot of sense, Carlos, for sure. Uh, but it also has been known, California, as the ATM for the Democratic Party and for President Obama. So truly, he is here to, to make some money for Pelosi. And also, I understand that um, uh, another... Uh, now I'm forgetting his name. Another primary uh, Democrat was here as well at the Magic Johnson event. All right, so it doesn't seem like the president is going to uh, obey our cues, so we'll throw it back to you. You got it. There's lots to talk about still because uh, the president continues his visit tomorrow as well. So